All right, I'm going to let y'all watch the game with me right quick. Uh, and every time something happens, I'm going to check in and with, with you. Now, the first play of the game, Tony Romo's ball was batted down by the defensive lineman. I'm telling you, keep an eye on that because they're going to keep Romo in, a, in the pocket and they're going to get their hands up because Romo's kind of short. So let's check it out. Pretty 30 yard pass to Patrick Creighton, wasn't it? On the sidelines. Like that. Like that from Tony Romo. Lynch got Julius on the outside, and that's what Wade's doing in this offense. He's getting Julius on the outside rather than running it off the middle. I like that. I like the way they're using Julius so far. Grammatica missed it. Wide right. Not good for Grammatica. On the first, even though they completed that screen, I like that blitz because last year we wasn't getting past that first line. But maybe it was a screen and maybe they let them through. So let's, let's see later on. That's what I'm talking about, sack. So three and out, first possession for the Broncos. Again, you see it, Julius is getting around that corner. And I'm telling you, this is the way that, that, that Jason Garrett is going to use Julius. And this is going to make Julius a much more dangerous runner than he was last year. Promise you. Nice catch by Sam Hurd on the third down. Tony Romo did a great job getting out to him. And Sam, I'm telling you, he's going to get a lot of playing time this year. Marion Barber touchdown. It's, it's like so easy for him when he gets down toward the line, man. He just jumps over everybody or ran over, runs over everybody or something, man. So 7-up. Either, I think, either we looking real good on offense or Denver's real bad on defense. And it's hard to think that Denver is that bad on D. But, hey, we'll find out during the season. Spears gets the fumble. I'm telling you, I love that Marcus Spears. Julius is going to have to keep his legs on the ground, man. He don't need to be jumping up in the air in the NFL. Somebody need to send him an email about that or something. JJ showing people that he can score down on the goal line. Nice job, JJ. I, I'm really liking, uh, I'm liking what he's doing this season so far. Good job, Wade. Good job, Jason Garrett. Good job, Tony Soprano, and I'm saying Soprano on purpose, people. Anthony Spencer lost a little contain on that uh, Travis Henry run. Keep an eye on him. Nice tackle, Marcus Spears, man. He's, he's showing up today. All right, in the first quarter, 14-0. Marion the Beast Barber. This is why I love him. He's just running through people. Dre Blod just got Tony Romo. People, don't you love our receivers, boy? Patrick Creighton. Anytime we need something, we can go to Patrick Creighton or Witt. And both of those guys are there when we absolutely need it, man. Great catch, Creighton. You guys got to see why I love Marion Barber so much, man. Another touchdown, Marion Barber. It's going to be like that all season long, people. And right after Patrick fumbled, then... Sam heard, and it looked like Sam just took off running before he like had the ball secured in his hands. Um, Sam's been doing great. No problem there, dog. No problem. Anthony Spencer made a good stop to stop that drive, you know, after the Tony of Romo interception. So we only gave up three points. So pretty good. Anthony Spencer did a good job here, guys. I mean, on Daniel Graham, he got down there. He, he knocked the ball, but... The ball went up in the air instead of down, and, and the dude still caught it. So, still, Anthony Spencer was there. He had a good job on um, uh, on coverage right there. Hey, guys, great job by Anthony Spencer. He got back there and got in Cutler's face to where Cutler forced Cutler to throw it out the back of the end zone. So, good job, Anthony Spencer. Three points for Denver, not a touchdown. Okay, we didn't look that good on the two-minute offense. However, 52-yard kick for Nick Folk. Looked like he had a lot more foot in it to make it even longer than that. I'm, come on, guys. I, I think the kicking deal is over. All you Grammatica fans out there, get out the tissues. Might be gone. What the hell is Palesco doing out there with my number two on? Burnett just crunched somebody. <laughs> Late on the play. Boy, Tyson Thompson is fast, man. You see the way he hit that, uh, hit that corner? It's faster than Julius, I think. Burnett just crunched the running back again. Burnett's trying to show something. I've always liked 
Wow, Nate Jones just got burnt by Brian Clark, I think. Wow. Thing was like 90 yards, 89 yards, 91 yards. Uh, Tyson just hits these corners like crazy, man. That dude, I think he's faster than Julius, you ask me personally. Isaiah Stanback made a nice catch. I think it was. The dude said Andy Thorne, but it looked like 86 to me. Stanback's out. Beautiful catch by Isaiah Stanback, man. We were all waiting to see this guy, and now we're seeing him, and I like it so far. Uh, Brad Johnson did a good job too, so I've been kind of dragging Brad, but good, good work, Brad. All right, Patrick Ramsey drove him down the field for a touchdown. It mainly was a um, interference call on Joy Thomas. So Joy, Joy Thomas did some good things in that um, in that drive, and he did a few bad things again. So he's working toward a uh, place where he can contribute to this team. So I still love Joy Thomas. All right, pretty get, good good game, man. Uh, that Alonzo Coleman is a pretty good running back, man. I didn't get to see him during training camp because he was hurt or whatever. But um, nice game, 31-21.